It was a tough journey going from an intern to a senior professional. Now to protect my savings against high inflation and grow my wealth, I invest in bonds with INR Bonds. Download the INR Bonds app to save better. Hello everyone. Welcome to Search for Reels fortnightly newsletter from INR Bonds. I'm Nikhil. In today's uh, topic, I'll be discussing with you about the recent debt uh, issuances, both private placement and as well as uh, IPOs. Uh, from uh, if if you're following us uh, quite often on the YouTube, then you would be knowing about uh, we explain on uh, after effects of RBI's uh, unsecured loan uh, risk weight increase, and we also explain that we are see we saw the uh, the yields rising up for NBFC as the liquidity dried up completely, but uh, I will just give a further update and uh, a slight. Uh, a different angle uh, from the recent interviews we got it from different lenders uh, so at one of the very big conference uh, one of the lenders one of the south based lender has said that uh, definitely uh, the the liquidity has dried up for fintechs uh, especially who are operating in the unsecured space so uh, they they are going to likely to either go for a uh, m and acquisitions or they're going to go to the market with an uh, absurd uh, uh, yield level to raise money and uh, and the nbfcs are also uh, looking at taking a another uh, angle or uh, they're recalculating the risk assessments against this uh, exposure to uh, fintechs uh, especially who are uh, giving unsecured loans also the banks and nbfcs they're also seeing uh, a quite uh, tightening of liquidity in the market and uh, the that, that's the reason we saw the gsec yields uh, and the whole market yields uh, going uh, slightly uh, rising by almost five basis points for a triple a triple a paper and 10 15 basis points for a double a and double a minus paper in the uh, last uh, two weeks uh, and the market participants are likely to expect rbi to maintain the same stance uh, without making a lot much of lot much of changes rbi is going to review the data on this unsecured loan guys and which is going to happen in the uh, obviously in the next maybe uh, in 2024 policy meeting but this policy meeting it's going to be wait and watch kind of a types from the policy makers so hence uh, uh, in order to meet the uh, regulatory requirements of capital adequacy ratios we are seeing uh, many of the lenders coming out with uh, debt ipos uh, public ipos and private placements uh, having said that uh, coming to the topic uh, so Let's I'll take you through the recent uh, and upcoming public data issuances. Uh, Cholamandalam has uh, done around a uh, thousand crores or rupees, ten billion uh, through public data IPOs, and in the last week, where they were offering a uh, two year, three year, and five year, two year was like around eight point four, and the three year around eight point five and eight point six for a five year paper, uh, and the the IPO was successfully uh, sailed through, and it has been closed already, and we will see the bonds uh, coming out for the secondary market offers this week. And the another one, another issuer which is lined up for uh, the uh, fresh issuance was uh, is uh, IAFL Samasta Finance, and it will open on fourth of December. And they're they're also targeting for a thousand crore with a two hundred crore plus eight hundred crore issuance. Uh, in this uh, IAFL Samasta, we are, we have uh, the two year paper, which is a monthly. They're offering a monthly and annual paper. The two-year paper is offering around 9.21 and uh, one, uh, annual paper is offering 9.6% and three-year paper is offering a monthly coupon of uh, 9.57 and uh, annual paper, annual uh, yield of 10% and five-year paper is offering monthly of 10.23 and 10.5% uh, and IFL Samasta is a double A minus paper uh, and uh, uh, coming to Arca FinCap which is a uh, part of uh, Kirloskar group and they're also coming out with a uh, issuance of uh, 150 plus 150 uh, uh, crores uh, with a green show option of 150 crores and this also uh, lined up uh, in this week and it's going to open on 7th of December. Uh, so here this uh, arc of cap is rated AA minus uh, and the, the two-year paper which is a quarterly they're offering quarterly and annually and the quarterly one is offering 9% and annual one is offering 9.3. Three-year is offering 9.3% quarterly and 9.6 for annually. And the five-year is offering 9.65% uh, quarterly and 10% annually. Uh, slightly our cuff and cap, uh, uh, given the uh, good parent and uh, uh, the parent uh, support, it has come with a slightly uh, better yield, fine yield than the comparative peer group. 
where the peer group or uh, the two year like if we take the credit access gramin uh which has which has got recent uh, credit rating upgrade from uh, crystal to double a minus the two year paper you get it at uh, 9.4 percent whereas arca is offered at uh, 9.3 so uh this thing uh again as i said uh this all uh differences in the price yields and all will get uh sorted out once it uh, comes to the secondary market and in the private placement space uh we have seen uh a very uh uh this double a double a minus issuers uh they they issued bonds in the same year like three four months back uh at a certain level and now they're issuing bonds at uh, uh 50 basis points or 60 basis points for the similar maturities and higher than the previous uh, levels uh, obviously, to compensate the investors uh, for the risk they are taking, and the, given the market condition where uh, uh, the investors are demanding for higher rates as the liquidity dried up, and RBI also noted said that there are going to be a lot of uh, scrutiny over uh, what kind of where the lenders are issuing the uh, where they're borrowing the money to. So, given all that, uh, the market, the secondary market. Uh, we have seen uh, the yields uh, rising up. Thank you for listening in and uh, do subscribe to our YouTube channel uh, if you're not done so already. Uh, if, you're, uh, if you want to invest into the IFL or ARCA IPOs, so for you, the best place is to uh, go to the Quick Invest by INR Bonds. The app is available on both App Store and Play Store. You can uh, download the app now and uh, start placing your bids for the, both the IPOs. The minimum investment is 1,000 crores, uh, sorry, 10,000 rupees. And you can uh, place your bids through uh, the app and pay the payments through the UPI. And if you are a financial advisor, if you want to place bids for the for your clients uh, for these IPOs, you can sign up on Partner Portal and uh, uh, and place the bids for your uh, clients and also access uh, our curated list of secondary market offers to grow your assets under advisory. And also, you can give the best quotes to your clients with the transparent and uh, uh, pricing information. Attention financial advisors, want to attract new business and customers? Offering a new asset class is the key. With debt mutual funds and MLDs losing their tax advantages, your clients need to diversify fast. Look no further than corporate bonds, the perfect solution for safety and good returns. Partner with INR Bonds for expert guidance and valuable resources to get started. Access a wide range of bonds on our portal and manage your client investments with ease. Visit partners.inrbonds.com today and unlock new business potential.